Investigators say Colorado mom Kelsey Barrett is dead more than a month after she was reported missing. They are continuing to search for her. Here's a timeline of the events leading up to the arrest of her fiance, who was charged with her murder. Thursday, November 22nd, Thanksgiving. Surveillance footage shows Kelsey with her one-year-old daughter entering a Safeway supermarket in Woodland Park, Colorado around 12.30 p.m. Investigators say her fiance, Patrick Frazee, reported he saw Kelsey that day when she handed off their daughter to him. Cops say it's the last time anyone has reported seeing her alive. Kelsey's phone gave a location near Gooding, Idaho on November 25th at about 5.13 in the afternoon. We've executed search warrants on Kelsey's home as well as both of her vehicles. We are treating Kelsey's disappearance as a missing persons case at this time. On December 2nd, Kelsey's mother reports her daughter missing and police launch an investigation. The next day, police ask the public for information about Kelsey's whereabouts. Two days later, her family creates a Facebook page to raise awareness for Kelsey. We've created the Facebook page, Missing Mother, Kelsey Barrett. On December 10th, her mother made a public plea to help find her daughter. She doesn't run off, and someone knows where she's at. Kelsey, we just want you home. Call us if you can, and we won't quit looking. An attorney for Frazee says he didn't attend the news conference because he was only informed about it an hour before it took place. We would like to go ahead and light those up for Kelsey. December 13th, Woodland Park. A vigil is held for Kelsey in her community where people came out to pray for her safe return. What can we do? You can't, we don't know what to do, so sometimes this is what we can do. You know, if you can come out and pray with each other and hold each other's hands and lift each other up and hope for the best, sometimes that's all you can do. The next day, law enforcement officials execute a search warrant at Patrick Frazee's home. His attorney at the time said Frazee was not asked to participate in the search and would not make any public statements as he continued to care for his daughter. It's unclear if investigators found anything relevant to their investigation. On December 18th, a friend of Frazee, Sonia Oliver, defended him in an interview with Inside Edition. You think he possibly had anything to do with his fiance's disappearance? I couldn't imagine him uh, doing anything that would harm anyone. You personally do not believe he had anything to do with it? I just can't imagine Patrick doing anything like that. Friday, December 21st, Patrick Frazee was arrested charged with murder and solicitation to commit murder, according to the Woodland Park Police Chief. However, there was still no sign of his missing fiance. While we have not found Kelsey at this time, information has been developed that is helping to narrow down our search. As you can tell from the arrest, sadly, we do not believe Kelsey is still alive. Authorities said their evidence suggests Kelsey was killed in her home. The couple's daughter was reunited with Kelsey's family. Patrick Frazee is currently being held without bond.